New Holland specialized workshop. An experienced master mechanic. And your question. My name is David. I'm here to help you keep your machine in good shape. Machines are assets to be safeguarded and good maintenance combined with original spare parts does make the difference. Take David's word for it. Hi everyone. I've just received an interesting question from Leandro, a Spanish farmer who works with a New Holland machine. He tells me that a friend of his has suggested a trick to save some money. He says that you can clean the air filter by simply blowing compressed air onto it in order to avoid substituting the component. It's not a wise suggestion at all, my dear Leandro, and I will explain to you in a while the reason why you shouldn't do that. But first, let me explain what the functions of air filters are for those who don't know. The air filter plays a key role in effective fuel combustion. It is positioned upstream of the combustion process and it's used to rid the air entering the engine of impurities. And it's basically made of three different elements. The metallic structure, the filtering material, which ensures that all the particles are stopped while the air is allowed to pass through, and the seal. If the latter component is defective, it is no longer able to ensure a perfect seal, allowing air to travel from the outside to the inside of the engine without passing through the filtering material. Only original components can guarantee an optimal seal and perfect engine protection against dust and moisture. So, Leandro, going back to your question, it's absolutely not recommended to use compressed air to clean the filter because doing that, the fibers of the filtering material can be damaged. And if a hole appears in this material, it will allow dust to pass into the engine interior. Your friend will save a little money for the filter, but will shortly damage the engine, and that's far more expensive. The simplest solution is just to adhere to the manufacturer's recommendation in terms of maintenance. Take David's word for it.